Yeah, I must make sure the Knights of the Order aren't killing civilians. Christ, man. Hi, guys. Oops. <laughs> the humanity of it all. I thought there was loads of them, but there's just this guy. Wrong style. That's more like it. Look at the blood! Hey, more elves to slay! Oh, there you are. Uh, quick style. Yeah, you better fight me. You're doing no good, though. Don't hit any of the order because they'll get all. Oh, God, crap. No, stop, stop, stop. Don't don't attack any of the order because they'll all go hostile and that would be bad. Um, Knights of the order, you're not killing civilians, right? Forty-two gold. So I thought it was a donut then. Be a bit weird, wouldn't it? Well, Shani hated me anyway. Oh, more of you. Just want to make sure he doesn't uh, attack any of the order. Uh oh. I better take a potion. Quick shot. Or not and just run. So I guess we have to just make a run for it here and go to Old Vizima. Gracious sire, this is madness. You should not expose yourself to such danger. Wait here and allow me to summon a stronger force. Nonsense, Velorad. This is my city, the capital of my kingdom. Damn it, I rule this land, and I refuse to creep around its corners. Gracious sire! Silence! You know you might as well wipe your ass with those intelligence reports. I want to see it with my own eyes. <laughs> I trust you are not too late. Your kingdom is in need. <laughs> you should know kings are never late, Jacques. Sire, flames engulf half the city, and the blood of your subjects fills the gutters. This is no time for word games. You must act. What do you propose? Allow me to command your army, and the freedom to do as I see fit. Never. Over my dead body. It was close this time. Next time, I might arrive too late to help. I've seen enough. Velorad, back to the castle. What is he doing here? He dropped in. He seems to have a talent for that. What shall I do with him? He'll come with us. I have a matter to discuss with him. Witcher of Rivia. Sire, I am honored. 
As I'm sure you surmised, I have not summoned you here out of whim. A serious matter weighs upon us. A curse binds my daughter. I want you to remove it. I have gathered all who might offer aid. Dewet has been the princess's adjutant for the past half year. Velarad has known Ada since her childhood. And Triss Merigold is here for her extensive knowledge of magic and female intuition. Mm -hmm. Consult them and think upon this matter. We shall speak about it again soon. As you wish, Your Highness. In the meantime, equally urgent issues demand our attention. I'm listening, sire. Witcher, imagine returning home from an excursion against a monster, a Kikimor, for instance, only to discover your home a whorehouse. Your Highness. I'm not finished. Those you left in charge failed you. A traitor threatens to oust you from the home of your ancestors. Wouldn't you be angered? Would you not elect to shed more blood? Absolutely, sire. The non-humans must pay. With your backing, the order... Unfortunately, the knights have forgotten their place. They've developed a taste for power and want more. That is not something I can allow. You stood by while the order's power increased. Perhaps you should negotiate with the Grand Master. And perhaps I should behead the Grand Master and his underlings. That would solve the problem. Sadly, it's not that simple. I'm certain you're right, sire. I must attend to some urgent matters. Speak with these excellent minds. Gain their insight. And don't forget my daughter, Witcher. I'm counting on you. I won't forget. My servant will summon you when I have more time. Right. Triss, Valorand, and Duet. Well, I know them all quite well. But first, before we get into all that, uh, Chapter 4. I really enjoyed. I liked it a lot. It's a nice uh, break of break of pace, really. Um, you did wonder how it would coincide with like the main plot, because you're outside in the middle of nowhere, effectively, like even more than in Chapter One. Um, but yeah, I, I did enjoy it. It was a nice break of pace. I know I missed some stuff. I forgot some stuff. I forgot the armor quest. I forgot to talk to the hermit. I I didn't get a monster, and uh, I know I'm going to get comments about that. <laughs> Um, I was kind of, well, I didn't rush it towards the end, but I got into it, you know, and I was like, oh yeah, let's go, let's do this, and, um, I've noticed that there's no way of telling, like, when I talked yes. to the Lady of the Lake that time, and she knighted me and gave me this sword, uh, that was like the time when I couldn't go back and do any other quests, you know, because that was when the, yes, because that was when, um, that's annoying. The knight showed up and so I couldn't turn any more quests or uh, blah blah blah. And there, w there wasn't really a, a way I could have known that. Yes. No, there wasn't. Stop arguing. Um, yes. But I did enjoy that chapter. We're on the last chapter now and then the, then the uh, prologue. Waste of words. Oof, wasn't it just? No one listens to me anyway. Yes. I don't like you guys. Well, we'll talk. Oh, this is all a bit extravagant, isn't it? Talk to Triss first, I guess. Hi, 